champion Cleveland Browns taking on the champions from the NFC, the Carolina Panthers. With Charles Davis, as always, I'm Brandon Gordon. Charles, you talk about storylines in this one. I think it begins and ends with our two quarterbacks, certainly two of the best in the business. And nowadays, I don't think you can get by for long periods of time without a top-flight quarterback. The way the game is played, with all the responsibility he has and how the game flows through him, if he's not on the top of his game, your team's not going to benefit at all. Come the Panthers now, set to take over on offense. Here's Davis, throwing to start the drive. That one to the former Brown, Jarvis Landry. And they're going to get this to about the 44-yard line. As a passer, you're always trying to find that open window to throw the ball downfield. How about this one? Right in the middle of the field, right in the heart of the defense. To throw again on second down. Davis. That's caught by his tight end, Kylan Branson. And he's going to be taken down at the 28-yard line. Nice job. Nice patience right there. Put him on the right side. Let him work his way across. Put the ball in his hands and let him work his way upfield with a catch. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. Back to throw. Davis. He'll get this to Lazard. And he's going to be marked down just outside the 10. And now timeout is whistled as it appears there's a Brown shaken up on the play. Now a first and 10 at the 11. carry of the game for Christian McCaffrey. And he'll get this one down to about the 10-yard line. Just a yard on the first down carry, so it's second and nine. Looking to throw. Davis. This will be caught at about the six. They'll give him four yards there, and it brings up third and five now. Back to throw. Davis. He's got it for a Panther touchdown. Alan Lazard from six yards away. And the Panthers are on the board first here in this Super Bowl. Both sides of the football in sync early. You force the three and out, and then you take it down score points. You know what that tells me? This is their game plan. Their quarterback in this offense heading back out to the field. He connected on all five of his throws on that opening drive and finished it with a touchdown pass as they begin here first and ten. They start on the ground with McCaffrey. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. Operating from the gun. Davis, Landry, agile footwork, and they've got it well across midfield, down to the 40 before it's all said and done. A gain of 28 yards there and give them a first down. It's almost as if they didn't leave the field after their first drive. They picked right up where they left off. Another good throw there. And this offense, humming here in the early going. This is McCaffrey on the give. And this time they were waiting for him as he'll be knocked down before he can get back to the line of scrimmage. So after the loss of a yard, they'll look to push forward here on second down and 11. That's complete right side to Lazard. And they're going to have another first down as he's going to be tackled at the Browns' 24-yard line. Three catches for him now in this first quarter of the Super Bowl. Now a give, right side of McCaffrey. They get him to the ground right on the cusp of the red zone after a pickup of five or six. After one, seven-nothing on EA Sports. 
And we are back. Biggest game of the year, the Super Bowl, and both teams ready for the start of the second quarter. Second and five now. Davis over the middle and into the hands of his receiver, Moore. And the Panthers are going to have a first and goal as he'll be taken down at the seven-yard line. And that's a more than acceptable read right there because it's zone coverage. So timing is everything. This time he went for his man to come open, puts it right on him, and they pick up a first down. And he's got it. Touchdown, Panthers. Alan Lazar, his second touchdown of the Super Bowl. And the Panthers continue to look good here in the first half of this Super Bowl. Well, this has been a flawless start for them. They score, they get the stop, and they score again, Charles. Complimentary. Their quarterback leading this offense back out. He's got two touchdown passes on his first two drives, and he'll try again here on drive three. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And nothing much materializing there on the first down run. He'll get a couple, and that's it. They'll break the huddle, come up on second and eight at the 27-yard line. Looking to throw. Davis throwing middle, and it's complete. That's good. The completion there for seven yards. And that'll leave him with a third and just a yard. to throw. Davis. And he's got the hook up to Moore. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. Nine yards that time. Gotta say, I was a little surprised to see him, Charles, come out in the shotgun on third and less than a yard. Yeah, but the way the NFL is nowadays, we hardly ever see him really run for it on short yardage. So they're going to throw the football more times than not. That was a nice, easy rhythm throw right there, and they pick up the first down. Two yards, the loss, second and 12. Two minutes on the clock in the second quarter of this Super Bowl. The running lanes have definitely not been there for him here in the first half, and I don't think it's all been his fault. His offensive line hasn't given him much space. A loss results there. On second and 12, Davis. Got a man over the middle, and it's complete. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. That hold coming from the left side of the line. Hands got Still caught in the cookie jar on that one, and the flag came out. Penalty against him. Davis now to throw on second down. He's got the hook up to Lazar. And a timeout is whistled as it appears there's a Brown shaken up on the play. The medical staff will attend to him, and we will step aside. Out of the gun now on third down. Able to find Lazar. And they're going to have another first down as he's going to be tackled at the Browns' 30. And now it looks like they're going to be in the hurry up. to the ground attack here. It's McCaffrey. And he's got it down to the 28. Well, they certainly had success throwing the ball on this drive, and not as much running it as we just saw once again on that last play stopped after a very short game. But I wouldn't abandon the run totally, because otherwise, pass rushers just tee off on your quarterback. It makes it very, very... And it'll be caught in the end zone for the Carolina touchdown by D.J. Moore. A great play there. 28 yards, and the Panthers will extend their lead in the final minute of the half. Well, just a sensational start for this offense, Charles. Three drives, three. Out is their quarterback of this offense to take over once more. He had the They'll indeed start on the ground to run that clock. And he'll just burrow his way back to the line of scrimmage, and that's about it. So we've reached halftime here. So the halftime.
Davis on first down. And he's taken down. This will be a Brown sack. It looks like a loss of right around 11 there on first down to set him back on second. Well, they're in some hot water now after that sack. It's second and 21. Now pass complete to Moore. And not much happening there. He's taken down, but a late penalty flag in the backfield. This looks like a roughing call. So roughing the passer penalty, never one that you like to see. Not at all, and especially when you're in that final push of the season. You can't afford to get your quarterback hurt before the playoffs roll around. And we know they'll be here before you know it. McCaffrey following the penalty. And some room to run now. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. It's another first down on a big gainer there, 33 yards. Sometimes it's hard to believe, but there are times this game is about patience, isn't it? Has had the game he expected, but that run there, that may get him going. I was just going to say, maybe that gives him a little juice, because you're right, he struggled, especially in that first half. Yeah, and I know the great ones always think to themselves, just hang in there. Just one big carry away from busting this open, that's a good start for him. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit him, but now they got to get. And he'll get in. He's over for the touchdown. It's their quarterback scoring on the sneak from a yard out. And the Panthers will extend their third quarter lead here in this Super Bowl. Instead of having to play follow the leader there, the leader led. And now this offense comes back out onto the field. Now Davis throwing to start the drive. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. And he's going to be dropped following a pickup of seven past the 30 to the 32. Well, it's time for them to be good teammates right here. And what I mean by that is possess the ball for a little while, get at least two first downs, give their defense a chance to settle down a little bit after they give up a touchdown. Throwing again on second down. Davis, he's got Granson, his tight end. Uh, he's trying to protect his quarterback's blind side. Got nabbed for the hole. You have one job over there. Make sure that man does not get hit. So if you have to hold occasionally, do so because they don't catch all of them. This time they did. Got a man. That's Lazard. And yeah, they'll get it all the way up about five yards shy of midfield. 23 yards to pick up there. And as a quarterback, you always want to exploit gaps in the defense. And he finds one here. Crossing route, working from right to left across the field. And once you get defenders going in the wrong direction, it is awfully hard for them to pivot back. And you end up getting the first down. And they're going to get this down to about the 37. I'll tell you what, a lot of those mid-range throws have been available because sometimes teams get too concerned about the deep ball. They leave too much space in front of them. And these guys have been taking advantage so far. And the result here, a pickup of eight. Leaves him with two to go on second down. You know what really fires up offensive linemen? When the guy that is carrying the ball behind them can create his own space and break a tackle along the way. Second down and right back to McCaffrey. And he'll go down here right around the 23-yard line. And now timeout is whistled as it appears there's a Brown shaken up on the play. Well, now they're going to come out and take a look at this injury, and we'll be back in a moment. They stay on the ground. McCaffrey again. And he'll keep it moving down to the 15-yard line. Seven yards on the pickup there, and it'll leave him with a second and three. On second down, McCaffrey. And he'll go down, and that will do it for the third quarter of action. An entire season coming down to this next quarter. Three in the books here in the Super Bowl. We'll return with more after this. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. From the third team now, they work on first and ten. 
Folks, welcome back to the biggest stage in sports, the Super Bowl, and now we get down. And he will take it across for Panthers touchdown. Christian McCaffrey, a 13-yard touchdown run. And the Panthers are starting to pull away in the fourth quarter of the Super Bowl. You talk about certain guys just having a nose for the end zone. He's one of them, and he was not going to be denied there. And defensively, especially in the red zone, you've got to be able to at least slow. And the Panthers coming out now. Here's McCaffrey. Now he's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good gain of nine on first down. Ball at the eight here for second and a yard. Maybe a touch less. McCaffrey. Oh, look at the juke. 97 yards rushing for him now. A big part, no doubt, of why they lead in this Super Bowl. What a hell partner. Marvin, our number one stats guy, just handed me a little card that says he has 97 yards on the ground today. You think he's going to get the ball again? Uh, I think so. Three away from that century mark, got to have it. Yeah, and I think what they're going to call is one of his favorite runs, whatever he feels comfortable with, but what the offensive line has executed well today to try and get him over 100 yards. They'll try and sneak it here. And he is over the line for another no. Is he a quarterback or is he a tailback? A great effort there. His second touchdown of the Super Bowl. And the... Feeling good as they extend their lead in the Super Bowl. This offense back out and set to go for their next drive. And they are trying to play it cool down on the sidelines, but they know that they are very close now to wrapping this thing up and letting the celebration begin. A Super Bowl title within reach now as they try to polish this thing off. The drive begins with a run by McCaffrey. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folding like a lawn chair. Two yards, the loss, second and 12. Operating from the gun, Davis. He'll find Lazard here over the middle. And yeah, he takes this one down almost all the way to the 30. 22 yards there, a first down. The passing game continues to be their friend, even with a stable lead here in the fourth, Charles. They're going back to that well. Yeah, with their overall philosophy, you know that they trust their quarterback. He's been able to throw it well. They continue to throw these safe passes. Who can blame them? A gain of three, second down. That gives him 98 yards in this game, and he's got to feel pretty good about that, but the entire offense does. The big thing, though, Brandon, they've got to get to 100, though. You think he knows he's at 98? I think someone has told him by now, and here's the thing. Getting to 100 or more is tangible evidence that you've had a nice day running the football, and that's what his offensive line wants for him and for themselves. Stopped at the 24-yard line after a gain of five. So it's Panther football as we welcome you back. They've got a third down now as they look for one more first down to help salt this one away. Operating from the gun, Davis. This is caught, and he doesn't quite make it, taking it with it an eyelash, dropped at the one. Well, they were in search of a short gain on third down, and they wind up now to go 20 yards. It's a quarterback sneak, and he is over the line for another rushing touchdown. Is he a quarterback or is he a tailback? A great play there with his third touchdown of this Super Bowl. And the Panthers are starting to pour it on to the game's biggest stage. They are running away with this Super Bowl. Possession of the football goes over to Carolina. 
Well, they don't really need the points here, Charles, given what we're looking at on the First down, this is McCaffrey. And they'll get this down to the 10. 118 yards on the ground for him now as he's gotten better, really, as the night's going on. Well, you know me, partner. I never tell him to back off of being aggressive, but sometimes you see the consequences when you're overly aggressive and you don't secure tackles. Guys break through. Trying to sell out to pry that football loose, and just as you said, Cost some yardage. Yeah, you gotta go get him. Stand him up first before you go for the ball. Don't just go for it initially. And they are gonna score again. Yet another touchdown as they just add to their totals. Some good running there at the end of the drive. He had the burst that set up the first and goal, and then one play later, he's in the end zone. Brandon, what I liked about that sequence is I'm not sure who made the play call. But they understood the situation, understood the momentum. A nice hard charging run, give it right back to him and let him cap things off. That's it, it's all over. And the Carolina Panthers are your Super Bowl champions. And their remarkable season ends in the most remarkable of ways. They get to put next to their name, Super Bowl champion. And they can't ever take that away, can they? Nope. That lasts forever. So good to see the emotion when it's all said and done. You see the hugs. You see the guys sharing the collective happiness. Makes me want to carry you around a little bit on my shoulders to celebrate the triumph. And congratulations to them. A fantastic season.